Hi, it's James from the XIR team, and in this video I'm going to show you how you can use XIR's keyword search feature to rapidly find images in Lightroom, even if they're hidden deep within your catalog, and even if you've never manually applied keywords to your photos before. So first you want to make sure you're in the Lightroom library module. You're going to come up here to library, plugin extras, and then from this list of XIR search tools we want to select search by keyword. You get this dialog box and on the left hand side you'll see a list of keywords. It's important to understand that these are the keywords that XIR has automatically applied to your images upon initialization. These are not user added keywords, they've been intelligently added by XIR's AI. So to find a specific image that you have in mind, you can just select the relevant keywords. If I want to see animal photos, for instance, I can just choose animal and then I'll see how many photos match the selected keywords within the area uh, that, I'm, that I'm looking in, that I'm searching in. Now clearly I have a lot of animal photos in my catalog, so what if I want to narrow it down further? I can open this up, so we're not looking just at animal, we can choose from specific animal types here and then say I, I want birds and I specifically want to look for my owl images. So I have 81 photos that match the selected keyword, the owl here. Um, and then I'm searching the whole catalog, not just the film strip, though I do have the option to, to just look in the selected Lightroom film strip. I'm just going to go ahead and hit start and we'll see what we get. So right away we end up with a slew of images from my catalog that show owls of different species. And that's exactly what I was looking for, but say that I want to narrow down my search uh, in another way. I can actually search by color as well, or filter by color as well. Come back to plugin extras, search by keyword, and I want to look this time, I'm going to get rid of the owl, for images of, say, sunsets. So I'm going to come under nature here, let me scroll down to where we've got sunset going to add that, but I don't just want any sunset image. I have 706 of those. I want red sunset photos. So I choose from this dominant colors palette here. Go ahead, I have this. 46 photos match the keyword. Searching the whole catalog. Then I hit start. And here's the result. A set of beautiful red sunset images from which I can choose the particular one I had in mind or just my favorite in general. And one more thing I want to add here is that Xire actually applies its keywords during the initialization process, but you can choose whether you want these to be visible in Lightroom. Right now, when I click here on, on this first ship photo, uh, I can actually come and look under the keywording panel on the right hand side and I can see the keywords that Xire has automatically added. Um, but this isn't always the case. If, if you can't see your keywords and you want to be able to see the keywords that Xire has added, you'll need to go to Library, Plugin Extras, and make sure that you've chosen one of the Transfer Keywords options. Or you'll need to make sure that when you're doing your initialization, uh, Here's the initialize photos option. You want to make sure that transfer keywords after initialization is checked. That way you can make sure that your keywords are always visible if you want them to be. Now, as I'm sure you can imagine, the XIR keyword search comes in handy all the time. When you want to find images of a particular type, so say photos of sunsets, for example, or even when you have a very specific image in mind that you're looking for. So go ahead and give it a try open up Lightroom Classic and see if you can retrieve some of your long lost photos from deep within your catalog. Thanks so much for watching.